Okay, welcome again to some Men of War action. It's going to be for you as a screen of the Kaj map. UK versus uh, Germany, and uh, yes. And uh, yeah, we're playing with maximum resources as well. So yes, I did of course mention previously that the game was in its twilight, but the band shall play on. Toward the very end. <laughs> Nice little Titanic reference there, I believe. But anyway, let's just get some SMGs to the front and, uh, yeah, probably get ambushed by vehicles and such, but what they'll. We'll see what happens. We'll just get the SMGs into position. Can't remember which ones are selected. Ah, okay, yep. Yeah. Just get this one over here, I suppose. And what the hell? I'll get this guy over here a little bit more forward compared to what I'd usually do, but uh, there you go. So, yes, yeah, UK versus Germany, our opponents. Well, that's going to favour. Um, Germany, everything else being sandbag. everything else being equal, but I think our opponents will be less experienced. Bizarrely enough, there are still people who actually play this game who seem to be relatively new, which amazes me actually, given how old it is. But uh, there you go. Amazing floating sandbag. Oh, and speaking of which, looks like a battle has been joined. We just set up a small tank room and Andy. <laughs> God, he didn't stand a chance. Oh, well. And what are these guys anyway? They're paratroopers? No, they're just riflemen, it seems. Well, it's not just standard. Let's see, what to send, what to send. Yeah, scratch just send it a girl dodge. <laughs> That's right, he was. Oh my god, I don't believe it. Well, they're kind of. Oh, no, wait a minute. Oh, a tank, of course. Well, what else is going to be? But anyway. Oh, what the hell? I guess I'll have to send this guy over here and try to get these guys just to. Salvage as best as we can. Damn it, he's facing that direction already. Damn it, I was going to flank from there. Well, I still can actually. It's going to be a little bit more challenging. <laughs> Down he goes. We'll better set up a few more, I suppose. And we must still be able to take out this tank actually from the side, hopefully. So, yes, yeah, Span shall play on until the end. Damn it, and I think he spotted me. There we go, hell destroyed. <laughs> oh, you gotta love this sink. Wow, it even blown up catastrophically. Now that was something I wasn't expecting. Anyway, time to crash this party from behind. No, no you don't. And, oh, never mind, there's still a few more of them actually. Ah, oh, thanks for setting the building on fire. Down you go. What the hell? Ah, oh, it's a... Oh, never mind, I'm not entirely sure what I actually got the engine in that case. Well, whatever. We can, I think these are soldiers, so we'll just get them to disembark. Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, or maybe not. That kind of sucks. Well, at least I can hopefully just destroy this with a well placed AT grenade. And maybe even blow up some soldiers as well. There we go. So, spectacular. Just spectacular. God, that was a great marker on myself there. Yeah. Oh, no, mind, he's actually got everything. Oh, that's right, because he picked up the stuff beforehand. Alright, well then. This building, I think this guy should get the hell out of here, and he's not going to be able to, of course. Well, whatever, hopefully he won't get set on fire being that close. <laughs> we'll see what happens in the case. Hopefully, uh, yeah, my life's going to be coming in to help. What I will do inst. Really, I can't get the crab yet. But when I can get the crab, I believe I should get it to. Oh, actually, I'm not really sure if I can really get it to take out this paratroopers. No, I get the 25 power instead. Why not? <laughs> just to watch out for these freaking trees. Actually, wait a minute, let's just blow up these trees. Ah, oh, bitch, got my turn. Fucking try. Okay, well, whatever, just get this thing. Up a bit closer then, since it's bloody over a little hill. A very slight hill, but just enough to screw me over. Now yeah, just freaking dandy. This guy appears to be surviving. For now. Oh, Panzer 4 HA. Wasn't that just dandy? What if I could try the same trick again? Take him out from behind. Actually, oh, actually no, 25 pound, I don't believe. Can take him out. Let's see. Hmm. Nope, not unless I get incredibly close. Which I will not. Anyway, can we actually get them now? Hopefully they hit the tree. Yes. How the hell did I not kill those infantry right next to them? Oh, I think the sandbags are actually in the way, really. That's good. Okay, 
Which I mean, it's what, what, I'm aiming between them. Maybe I can hit one of them, take out either the car or stun the tank. Either way, and yep, bloody trees and all that's in the way, of course. Uh, okay, we, we should be alright there. Alright. Well, this guy's bizarrely enough still alive, actually, so. Let's see if we can just get him to take out the tank. Maybe select his anti tank grenade. Oh, he's. Oh, well. Engine destroyed. Might have been set on fire, actually, as well, but uh, I guess now I never know. Actually, I suppose we can go out to this thing and steady with the shitty penetration. We should hopefully be able to get it. Okay. Uh, if I can actually hit it, that is. Well, I'd probably be just better off using uh, HE rounds, really. Yeah, there you go. Nicely done, old sport, nicely done. Alright, uh, probably time to send in some of my own real infantry as well, actually. We'll just send a couple of tank room and just police them. Why the hell is not aiming at it for fuck's sake? God, this thing's supposed to be aiming and shooting at him. God's sake, come on. And missing. He's meant to be doing that, I, I'm fairly certain. What, you can't expect uh, guns to actually hit anything? Uh, and of course, yep, there's our first quitter. Of course, although then again, he was in the negatives, so it might actually be doing his team a favour, actually. <laughs> yeah, but anyway. So, so I can't see much of that guy. Yeah, bizarre, actually. Yeah, that guy. Well, what the hell, maybe he actually will end up helping the team a hell of a lot, actually. In any case, yeah, they are starting to win, but, uh, yeah, going to be bringing up the full force of Britain uh, against them, and uh, surely they'll not be able to stand up against the King's men, perhaps. Or maybe they will be able to, anyway. Oh, never mind, that was already great. Yeah, I'll just set this guy up here, then. And, ah, oh, freaking AT gun, really. Well, at least this thing is actually aiming and shooting things, it seems. Let's try to get this thing. And, not really sure what the hell I just got there, but. Oh, it's a freaking insect as well. Oh, we're back in a second. Okay, back again. So, kill it. Ha! Alright, so anyway, it looks like the AT gun's been destroyed, and uh, yeah, bloody insect that just got in the way there. Yeah, because it's summer here in Australia, basically means that, uh, yeah, anything that can uh, crawl in through basically any fucking crevice, no matter how fucking small, is basically going to get in. Oh, good. Actually, yeah, good, this thing's really doing a good job. Anyway, it's basically going to get into your house, essentially. This if bloody thing's pretty much airtight. But oh well, what can you do? What can you do? Still though, means pretty good weather for the beach and all that. Went to the beach a bit earlier on actually. Pretty fun times indeed, to say the least. <laughs> Although it was a bit too windy for my liking. But anyway, what if I try to aim now? What will I actually hit? Oh, of course I'll actually hit my own guys. Whoops. Yeah, I should I should have seen that coming. Oh well, this thing can still shoot, I suppose. And uh, yeah, I really should have got something to just knock down these trees, actually. In fact, let's get something to do that right now, actually. I'm just got a crab to. to do that. There we go, and. Bam, bam. there we go. Hopefully, it should be able to waypoint alright there. Alright, well, some of my guys made it, I suppose. And lo and behold, we actually do have. Some rather annoying stuff going up against this as well. Could try getting it with an AT round, but uh, it's not going to do too much. I think I even got that guy from the side, but it was actually the Cromwell that ended up taking it out. <laughs> God knows what 
Oh, I just got there. <laughs> yeah, indeed. Hell of a shot, indeed. Oh, well, anyway. I can take this guy with HE. Let's see. Oh, for God's sake, what the hell is in the way there? Fucking trees or something? I don't know. Whoops, I didn't mean for it to knock down the AT gun. Huh. Interesting. I didn't think I'd actually do that. Uh, of course, I overestimated the AI. Well, you, you, for fuck's sake, what is it? I mean, if I was direct controlling it, fine. That would be pretty understandable. You think the fucking AI would go around a bit more? But nope. It does not. It just simply does not do that. Great. Ah, oh, that's right, we still have this thing to worry about. I forgot about that. Ah, yeah, yeah. God. Alright. Can't even reclaim from their bodies. Not bad. Well, I suppose I can try to reclaim from some other stuff instead. Actually, maybe I should try to actually capture this freaking point too while I'm at it. Oh man, he didn't even really picked up his fucking gun, really. Well, great. <laughs> Just great. Actually, given that close you can get, maybe I can actually take this thing out. So, no, 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 no. Oh, thank god. Alright, if we make a run for it. Damn it, he's going to die, of course. That sucks. Oh, and that's right, I forgot this thing is kind of going to be right in his uh, sights, actually. Does this thing have dynamite? I think it does. Kind of hard to tell the fucking thing being obscured. Whoops. This is meant to be over. Whoops. So long. Wait a minute. Did that just... It, oh, I just jettisoned it. Whoops. Oh, whatever. Let's just send it over here anyway. Bam. Bam. There we go. I'll send it around if I need to. <laughs> just suppose I do. Ah, indeed. At times. I bet I can't just ram this thing to destroy it. I never mind, it's been taken out anyway. Yeah, well, there you go. The opponent's still going and coming out with more yugged panzers, though. I mean, they're a spiffy little vehicle and all that, but really. Oh, speaking of which, I forgot about this tank crew. Let's see if I can do something with him, maybe. Nope, he's just going to die. Well, that kind of sucks. And he was meant to fucking knock this down. Wow, I can't believe the damage this thing's taking. Probably should try to get him away. Thank god he can take some light AT gun shots. Yikes, Panzer, damn it. Of course. Oh, well, it's just an iconic. Oh, what, what do you know? The uh, machine gun is actually salvageable as well. <laughs> Didn't suspect that. So, well, we'll set up a couple more tankmen, see what else I can salvage, I guess. This guy will just use him as a makeshift scout, and we'll take out this Yikes Panzer to avenge myself. Hopefully. <coughs> okay, so yeah, points back to being ours, and. Oh, wait a minute, does he actually see me? No, I don't think he does. Should I just... No, actually, no, I think it'll just be easier to go after this thing rather than the Tiger. I mean, Tiger would be a juicier Tiger, of course, but, uh, yeah, my guy's kind of in the wrong position for that. What the... Ah, oh, damn it, he took me out after all. Well, that sucks. Indeed. Let's see if we can put it on the endangered species this day. Ouch, there goes that guy. Actually, I should have a couple of tank crewmen arriving. I guess we'll just get this guy to salvage the Piat. Oh. No, he was a rocket man. Bond doesn't use rockets. <laughs> and there goes one more guy. <laughs> I think we're going to have to call it quits by the looks of it. Uh, well, really? Start after Tiger is dead. <laughs> there we go. We'll do that. And oh, he's actually going to back it up a bit. Doesn't want to restart just yet, it seems. Uh, not bad, not bad. The question is, what's going to kill? Ah, okay, another rocket man's probably going to kill it. So what the hell? We'll just wait a few seconds. Hopefully the tiger will blob catastrophically. Probably won't. He'll spot the rocket man in the case. Ouch! But he'll still take it out. Nicely done, old chap. Nicely done. But uh, yeah, as well, this is still alive. It's going to. Oh, it's only crew too. So what the hell? Let's maybe take out this thing as well. 
Really? That's basic. Don't want to restart the killing. It's interesting. He doesn't want to restart. Or no, oh, not too sure. Okay, let's see if we can get a flicking. Oh, he doesn't want to restart. Wow. Okay, that was quite a little trooper. Camo Killer 8, a name to remember. <laughs> not bad, not bad. Actually, I think I just heard an auto cannon firing as well. Ah, yep, the only kill on, of course. Actually, have I been done doing the comes? Yeah, at the bottom, of course, yeah. Yeah, it seems to get more points and all that when our opponents are actually pressuring us a bit more. Maybe because I react better to that pressure, or maybe because I mostly just sit back if there's nothing in particular to worry about. I mean, look at the points I've got. I can afford a turtle, land mattress, turtle being a bit of a joke unit, but still I can afford it, so that's what counts. And okay, let's just get a machine gun. I suppose I'll put this guy up here. There we go. We can demand it. And we'll have to get out of the machine gun, I suppose. They're definitely not going to get to this middle point. <laughs> Another tiger. Uh, not bad. Actually, wait a minute. Should be able to get one more dynamite. Ah, damn it, I want to get one more dynamite, please, for God's sake. Take out this other tiger, hopefully. Should I be able to do that? Lack of infantry around. Di oh, maybe not. Okay, then. Well, so much for that. Another tiger, eh? <laughs> oh, actually, what the hell? Let's send out the land mattress. I mean, I've knocked down pretty much every tree except for a few. Yeah, I think we give that a shot. Actually, what's. Can this thing actually reach over here? Let's see. Yes, it. No, it can't quite, damn it. Well, whatever. We've got the land mattress in the case, and I can almost afford a centurion again if I really need to. Although, I don't think I can afford both, actually. Almost can afford the centurion. Get this thing up to the fray near the case, and there we go. Damn it, he's going to get away, that bastard. Oh, well, what the hell. I see he got a bit of destruction underway, and oh, he thinks he's safe there, does he? <laughs> oh, he's got another thing coming. See if I can hit him now. Okay, maybe not. Oh shit! Ah. Damn it! I should have seen my last rockets man there. Well, whatever. It's um. <laughs> Just one launcher, but uh. Actually, he's the one with the shitty PC, everyone else has got a good one, so... There you go, too bad I kind of took out his rockets, man. <laughs> Whoops. Anyway, let's... Hopefully we took out the infantry that was around here, maybe I can take it out with the... Uh, dynamite, actually, let's have a look. The, what the... Oh, damn it! The same fucking rifleman. Oh, this is good. Alright, well... Whatever, we can still get this thing from the side. Good old dodge. Just to back a couple of soldiers. Let's just put them up here that in reserves. For God's sake, you meant to come in as a well, bastard. Wait a minute, did he just... Is that, did he just die? I think so. Not too sure. In any case, there we go, you got more land mattresses firing. So that would be the uh, second launcher. But by the looks of it, I think we've taken out the second tiger. Oh no, oh no, he's got a can of hand for eh? Just like that. And... Oh shit, he's going straight for me. Well, let's see if I can get him from the front, maybe. Okay. Never mind, he's using it like a light vehicle. Can I actually get him from behind then, in that case? Or the side, whatever. Just shoot for fuck's sake. Oh, for fuck's sake, why wouldn't I fucking shoot? No, I'm going to shoot anyway, just to see what happens. No. So I might have whole crush them, maybe not. And there goes player cameo killer. So he kept playing on the band played on there. <laughs> uh, so now I believe I shall restart. So <laughs> uh, 
Uh, and they had hell of a round, indeed. Yeah. There's the final tally, I suppose. Oh, that Norm got negatives. Pretty sure the only way you can get those is through team killing. Or by killing your own guys, actually. Oh, speaking of which. I suppose we can get take out these guys with some HE rounds. There we go. Gotta have that machine gun noise. What the hell even fine? Like a Beza? No, it's a Vickers something or other. Not so bad. And this thing it just keeps taking shot after shot. Uh, anyway, I believe that's the end, so. I'll see you all... Well, given that there's still a few minutes to go, I'll probably join this with another video, so I'll see you all in a second. <laughs> Indeed. Now, well, welcome back to some... Men of War action, once again, bizarrely enough. Mid and uh, yeah, we actually are getting some games going. Unfortunately, none of them have really progressed forward to the end without any quitters, which kind of really, really, really sucks. But uh, well, what can you do? It's becoming p rather par for the course when it comes to Men of War. That's what the hell. The band shall play on, as they say. I mean, it's the same guy as to where they're supposed to be going. And what the hell, we'll just capture as best as we can, so. This guy over here. This one over at Nya. And this one over Nya, just behind the point. Hopefully not too close to that, so if it blows up, it, it uh, won't kill him, hopefully. Now we'll see what happens. But yeah, so we'll keep on playing this until it's not possible to play online, I suppose. And uh, what the hell, I think Call to Arms is still in production as well as Men of War Assault Squad 2, so. What the hell? Hopefully uh, they'll actually finish production at some point and I uh, might even get them. In any case, enemy team starting out with Stuart, unfortunately it was taken out. Yeah, light tanks, some, not really something you'd really want to send in, you know, as if it was a light vehicle. You'd want to send in a light vehicle as if it was a light vehicle, strangely enough. But with tankettes, yeah, I would you really want to use them as um, more just light infantry support at the beginning. In either case, okay, finally they're capturing this point. Jesus, they really took their time there. Well, in either case, it got destroyed. I think I might just put up some AP mines, and there you go. Yeah, it might be a short game, although it might not be. Uh, whoops, <laughs> link. Alright, anyway, just uh, if you mind this point. <laughs> yeah, indeed. That seems to be uh, a plan that's followed by opponents all too often. <laughs> uh, indeed, anyway. Just put this all around the point, and there you go. Building Sim City, right. Well, actually, it's not really going to be much of a Sim City, but still. Oh, where is it? Hmm. <laughs> oh, there we go. I guess we'll just plan to do that. Now, what the hell? If I can just put this guy up front, maybe, just maybe, I can build a bit of a sim city myself. What the hell? Let's, let's do that, in fact. Uh, let's see. <laughs> anyway, um, okay, if I could we'll start with the... Uh, AT mines there, and we'll go with AP mines behind them. Oh, actually, they're on a timer. Oh, that kind of sucks. Well, whatever, we'll start with that, and uh, yeah, we'll just go on from there. Just AP mine and AT mine the shit, I really think. Actually, I think that that's what happened last time around when I was playing this game, if I remember correctly. Well, whatever. We'll see what happens. So, yes, yeah, so we'll AT mine around, well, sort of around the riverbank going towards, well, just starting off with the riverbank because I want to put some AP mines here. And, oh, wait a minute, we actually do have some SMGs. Hold the phone, everybody. I think we'll set up just a quick APC, really, because I think that's all that's really going to be necessary. We'll put a couple of tankmen in there, and... Damn it. Treat you bastards, eh? I wonder if this thing can go through the buildings here. Probably not. Oh, it can! Oh, damn it. Oh, probably because it's an armoured vehicle. One would assume. No, they're going to see me mining in either case, which kind of sucks, but oh well. What can you do? It's just 
start AP mining, uh, AT mining in either case. So we'll start there. Throw down some AP mines as well. God, that bloody blue haze makes it kind of tricky to detect what exactly I can mine and where I can't mine, but I think that should do the trick. Yes, perfect. Damn it, they're interrupting my mining, those bastards. Yeah, well, I've got a tank crewman right here ready to salvage. We'll just take care of their cover too while at it. Oh, I actually did have a couple of mines on him, who to think? Oh, so it's just this uh, this gap here, I believe, that we needed to do. So, oh, of course, the bloody body's going to get in the way. Well, whatever. Should hopefully be alright. And everybody else has finished mining. Now, let's send these guys forward just a hell of it. And looks like the 80 miners have. Good, they successfully mined. These guys also successfully mined as well. Perfect. Amando says, I suppose there'll be a tiny bit of a gap, but still shouldn't be too bad. These guys will just send them forward. Mindy. That guy's probably not going to do too well. Oh, that's a Panzer 4 range. I thought it was something else. Thankfully, though, it was only up against the M19. Those can be pretty nasty, though, from the side or from close ranges, though, so something to keep in mind. In any case, mining here is going to just keep on proceeding. And uh, maybe I should have actually put those mines kind of over here instead. Whoops. Oh, well. <laughs> in any case, these AP miners seem to have finished as well. And good, we'll just send them up here as well. Vector Mando. <laughs> Too high, and high, eh? Maybe. But anyway, get these guys to start mining. Sort of back down here to connect up with these other mines. Perfect. There we go. APC. Well, they're probably trying to hit some soldiers with that APC or something. It's funny that they actually did bring up my own APC, bizarrely enough. <laughs> to think. And my guys actually have made it to this point. <laughs> my god. Man. Yeah, let's talk about freaking SimCity indeed. Well, I'll also continue with the AP, uh, sorry, AT mining. So we've mined the riverbank. I think I'll just... Well, actually, I could just continue mining along here, actually. Why not? Oh. Okay, careful of that, never mind. I thought it was meant to be something a bit more significant. Apparently not. I might just put this guy over here, actually. Yep, that's it. Keep reversing. Just get rid of those trees. And we'll just send up this guy over here. Wait a minute. <laughs> that's right. Uh, but anyway, and these are the AP miners, I believe. Yep. Well, whatever, let's just send them over here. It doesn't really matter if they get killed off or not. And I know I'm revealing also where my miners and all that are, but I will screw it. So, where did they stop mining? Here, yeah, okay. Well, then we'll just continue. Moving, yeah. Perfect. Should probably cover it really. I suppose I'll send in some AP miners though, just in case. Just to cover a bit more. <laughs> Why not, eh? Hell, I could probably even mine this point actually. <laughs> oh, incredible, simply incredible. Oh well. Yeah, I'm just simply amazed still that there are people who play this game, who seem to be so new to it. I mean, it just boggles the mind, really. I mean, this game is so freaking ancient. I believe someone said at some point it was like 10 years old. <laughs> uh, incredible. Now, now what? I suppose the next thing to mind probably be this little point here. Oh, they might like actually AP mine quite a bit there. Yeah, that's that'll do. There we go. I suppose they can technically sneak around where they probably won't. And uh, well, I'm just going to have mines all over the place. It's almost like playing a uh, front lines mode, actually. Kind of wish you got artillery in that mode as the attackers. But oh well, what can you do? We'll just keep these guys up here in either case. And yeah, they say the mines should be pretty plentiful indeed. And yep, they sort of even bridge the fence as well. These guys, yep, they've finished. We'll just send them up forward as well. 
And oh, there we go. Now they're actually finally doing something. It certainly took their freaking time. <laughs> uh, not bad. Not bad. Oh shit! Damn it! They're going to run into my other guys, perhaps. No, my T miners. Uh, Screw it. I could send in something more significant after that. Oh, that kind of sucks. But uh, I think just a simple rocket manage to get the job done. Maybe a couple of tank crewmen as well to help pick up his equipment. Actually, wait a minute. This guy survived. Maybe I can get him to drop some dynamite. Wait, he's got one dynamite piece. That's better than nothing. Just have to make sure he doesn't get detected. Perfect. We still got this guy coming up here. Perfect, Amanda. <laughs> That's right. Morning jog indeed. Actually, maybe I can get this guy out from the middle. Actually, so I don't have any grenades or anything. Come on. Can he actually? Yeah, technically, should be able to aim at him. I think. Yeah, that's it. You go straight after him. Sean moves, boss. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it, I think they took out my guy that was going to go after him, though. Ah, well. It's Kenny, too. Ah, uh, so I don't think we actually did create it. Well, whatever, Scrot. Don't give a damn as long as I can take out something here. Oh, yeah, that's a just jog around and try to get the perfect position. So that's a great idea. I'm just try to get these guys forward as well, try to spot. And it's funny, actually, c destroying uh, USA tanks. With infantry like that, so usually playing as um, you know against the Germans, should I say uh, it's the other way around. Usually, you know, you, um, what would be happening is that the non-German player would be trying to sneak up to German, well, to Germans uh, armor and all that to destroy it, given how freaking tough it is. But no, we're actually doing the inverse here. Oh, speaking of which, better get these guys to beat a hasty retreat, perhaps. These guys, I believe, have finished. What the? No. Oh. There's actually a couple of spare wines there, so we'll just send them over here in any case. But this guy should be able to sneak by being out of any trouble. Oh, that's right, I forgot about this guy. Just wait a minute, this guy could probably get into this building, building should I say. This one, probably not. But no, not so much for that. Well, that kind of sucks. Oh, well, oh, actually we'll be able to get him to take out this thing. Even from the front should still be alright. This thing's only got the armour of an M4A2 after all. Like should shoot the thing. Yes, don't run over him though. Oh. <laughs> of course, it'd be run over. <laughs> oh well. Well, they're starting to attack once again, but I dare say they've got pretty good fortifications set up. In fact, what the hell? Let's set up. Oh shit, that sounds like he's got a graphics card problem there. I've never had the game do that to me. That's kind of disconcerting to say the least. Now, what was I going to do? Oh, that's right, I was going to pick up the tank man's equipment, uh, the rocket man's equipment. God, that really sucks though. Completely white. I've never heard of that happening before, and I've certainly never, happen, never seen that happen to, to myself at any point. Or on any PC for that matter. So, it could be his graphics card, I don't know. Completely white though, that's. I don't know, I never heard of that happening. <laughs> ah. Other screens work fine, just the game. Never had that happen. I've had other things happen. I mean, I've had the game crash at me and a couple of other bugs and all that, but uh, yeah, that's very bizarre. Uh, anyway, can we salvage this guy's equipment? Well, we can salvage the Panzer Shrek at the very least. I suppose it's better than nothing. And this thing, did I actually hold destroyed? I think I did. <laughs> I need to think. Well, get this guy to sell as a pantry trick, the other guy to go after the uh, guys there. Should be fine and dandy, but yeah, that's very odd indeed. Uh, I suppose. Oh my god, and he wasted it. You've got to be kidding me. I forgot to just die. There we go. Well, they could try minimizing it, I suppose. I've never actually minimized the game before, but I suppose it could be worth a shot. Try minimizing 
maximizing the next one. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Isn't that Glarfo? That's yeah, I think it is actually. Was he the one who was having problems? Oh no, it was Hatch Funder actually. Hatch Funder and ah, oh, whoops, never mind, it wasn't him. Okay, damn it. Well, in either case, that thing's been destroyed. I should still be able to salvage. Oh no, mind, I can't. Oh, I did that. Apparently, still didn't make a difference. Damn it. Damn it to hell. So also, I can't seem to get a. Need to get dynamite from somewhere. Look at the minimized preview is all white. Well, don't know, I guess it must be a game thing then in that case. Man, that really sucks. I mean, we're still winning, but still, kind of sucks indeed. Distracted, eh? I can do more than that. I can actually. Oh, I can actually get a stern tiger if I want to. Oh, probably not, but still. Not with the amount of points I still have out on the ground, which kind of sucks, but still. Fortunately, yeah, if she's gone, can you distract the one fortify? Yeah, I suppose I could actually, if why not? Come back, damn it. God, I've never had that happen before. Well, I guess we'll take the right, and. Should I get a Yacht's Tiger? The only problem is, though, if it gets to track, it's kind of dead in the water. What about it? Well, King Tiger's only 120, though. Oh, I could have afforded that if I didn't get the infantry. Oh, what the fuck, did I? Oh, I think he's got a sniper, actually. Well, let's see if we can take him out. Well, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. As you can see, it's starting to get a little bit late, but I still might have time. Yep, there was a sniper, of course. Of course. Well, whatever. Just these guys over here, over here, here. I actually should still be able to afford a King Tiger anyway. My points still haven't reached the uh, maximum by the looks, looks of it. And I can still search these guys as well. Perfect demando. So, Panzer Six Tiger. Wait a minute, is that what I... This is... Yes, it is. It's a King Tiger. Well, we might as well try to uh, squash whatever hope they have left and get a uh, second King Tiger, perhaps. <laughs> Bad angle by the sounds of it. Although I'm not entirely sure, to be honest. So, we've got a king... oh no, that's just a regular tiger. Where the hell's the king tiger, then? Oh no, this is a Panzer VI tiger, and this is also a Panzer VI tiger. Oh. Okay, it's like an improved tiger or whatever. Well, whatever. In either case, just set up a king tiger towards the right. King... right. The king of all tigers. Maybe yeah, some infantry too. Actually, I'll just get one of the tank crewmen to this crew this thing so we can work at full efficiency, hopefully. And yeah, this thing's just a complete beast. There's pretty much nothing in the game that can take it out head on from any decent range. I mean, probably can take it out with a point blank shot if you use something like an IS 3 or, say, a. Uh, what is the American uh, super heavy tank? The T something or rather? But anyway, so it didn't actually leave until now. Oh, that's interesting. We still get a performance drop experience. You'd think you could... Oh, I probably did alt 4 rather than exiting, exiting um, conventionally, actually. Oh well. In any case, yeah, this thing's just a beast, as I was saying. The, uh, oh, the T-29, I believe, is the American Super Heavy game in this game. Um, yeah, it probably can take this thing out from point-blank range, for God's sake, from the front. From the side, it's not obviously not, not as good, but it's still pretty damn powerful, actually. Just have a look at statistics. Yeah, its side is still 80 millimeters, and... Okay, well, maybe not exactly much sloping, but still better than I think. What the... Oh, it's just a heavy machine gun. I thought it might have been something more significant. Oh, well. There you go. No, you're freaking don't. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, they're probably going to despair a bit at seeing my King Tiger. They won't have too much. They can take it out from the front. Although, who knows, maybe this will actually spur the opponents to uh, be somewhat sneaky and taking him out. Who knows? Who knows? Eh? We'll just uh, have to wait and see. Actually, wait a minute. Let's see. Ah, oh, yeah, it's still alive. Well, we'll just uh, try to send something after him. 
Wait a minute, what's this? Oh, oh it's a Pershing. Tomato Sidearm is facing me. I think I might even be able to take it out like this. Oh, he pitched Kormats in. Well, in any case, he can't do anything against me. Especially since he's exposing a sign. I doubt he's exposing the front. Well, there's still not too much he can do. How crushed. <laughs> oh, I gotta love it. Just gotta love it. Yeah, certainly quite a beast of a tank. I probably should not be sending it this far forward, but oh well. I think we should be alright. Yeah, oh, great, hell of a miss it. Yeah, still need to watch out for bloody bazookas and all that, but still. We should be alright. Just see these guys maybe over there. Swats and yep, down he goes. So can you tiger taking him out? Can we take him out permanently? There we go. And Clash of the Titan. Speak of the devil, the T twenty nine himself. Well then. I still want to still, still have to watch out for him though. I still want to angle my tank as much as possible. What the hell's the armor on that thing anyway? There we go, okay. Yeah. Oh, he still wants to get closer, does he? So what is the armor? 178. And penetration is 178. So I'm going to have to get pretty... Whoops, I'm the wrong thing. 178, so about 70 meters. Oh man, and we've already won. Damn it, I wanted to see what would happen if I kept going up against him. Well, he's going towards me. Let's just see how this plays out. Damn it, the only problem is that I'm not controlling this thing. I think I would have done a better job than the AI would have it trying to, to target the weak points of this thing, but uh, it all destroyed it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, God, what a game. Alright, well, I'll see you all uh, next time. Okay, welcome back again to some Men of War action. It's going to be four, uh, sorry, 5 versus 5 on the Grand Suburb map, your say versus Germany, and uh, yeah, it looks like I'll be spawning on the right. So. Right, damn it, I probably should have just gone for a light vehicle rush. So there you go, 5 vs 5, Grand Suburb, USA vs Germany, we're playing as USA, if I didn't mention that already, and never mind, we're actually going to get an M20 to help us out, so that's pretty nice. Get mid, oh, I can never mind, yep, see which one is going to go to that, no problem. So, yeah, we had a hell of a round last round, actually, uh, if you didn't have a look at that, then definitely have a look at that. It was an 8 vs 8 on the port map, and uh, yeah, bizarrely enough, Barely anyone actually quit or lagged out, so pretty nice. I mean, most of the game I was just kind of rushing my men into uh, very well defended enemy positions, but what the hell, still a bit of action here and there. I probably should have varied up my tactics a little bit more. I uh, eventually decided to go with a bit more of a sneaky approach, but that was. Oh, damn it, why didn't he put a tank man in there, for God's sake, beforehand? Anyway, and then just run the siege man, uh, the siege man, the SMG over there. Ah, oh, don't you? Well, ah, oh, those are my guys actually, right, so they're off. Well, I guess we'll just take this guys over here. Here, and yep, they're going to it, run into the enemy. There we go. So hopefully they'll be able to do a bit of damage. This guy should not be sprinting. Whoops. There we go. Oh, thank god he sent his M20 back. Thank god indeed. Alright, and these guys are actually all alive, bizarrely enough. Yeah, definitely thanks for the uh, support. So we'll just send these guys over here to capture. It's interesting how they heal up on their own and all that, but anyway. Just give it to, uh, that guy to heal up as well, and shit, this guy really needs to heal up. They all need to heal up, really. But uh, before that happens, I'll just put down a couple of sandbags. Oops. Okay. And there we go, so we do have an initial advantage over opponents. Although, who knows, once they start getting things like heavy tanks and all that out, it might be very different. Damn it, this freaking area here is going to be a pain in the ass to defend. Now, we'll, we'll see what happens. Just put it up here, and there you go. Actually, what the hell, I might just even leave one guy up here, actually, just to sort of peek out over there. What the hell is going on here? Oh, shit, I didn't even notice it, I think. Was uh, like that actually. Well, I guess just sending in a, a uh, let's see, a lay should be able to do the trick just to provide a bit of fire support and take out basically anything that heads our way. And what? It's just an AT gun. Did it destroy his little tank perhaps? Perhaps it did. Yeah, well, it sucks to be him. <laughs> For fuck's sake, fucking face that direction. Everywhere. 
in the well, commiserate a bit. But anyway, actually, I'll just put one guy over here in case I do try to do a bit of a flank as well. Bam and bam, perfect. And oh, that's right, I forgot about this thing. Well, we might as well. We should have sent out more infantry. Actually, whoops. Okay, so this guy's up here. I'm just going to face you instead. And I believe we still got a man. This guy's going to pain the ass. All right, that's whatever. Let's just destroy him in that case. Although, oh shit! Just as I say that, the freaking looks comes back online. It seems. All right, that's well then. Going to attract my wrath then. That's too bad for you. Because as shitty as the gun on this thing is, they can at least do a bit of damage against slider tanks and all that. Try that again. There we go. I'll crush him. Was he? How? Oh no, I think only his engine was destroyed before. And there we go, fine, how destroyed. Alright, well, let's finish off the job against the uh, Puma, and uh, there we go, hopefully we should be alright. I guess what I could do also is maybe just AP mine this point as well, in case they do try to sneak around, perhaps. So, let's just go out to Conquer. Damn it, where the hell is he now? Ah, oh, there he is, perfect. I can get a trick shot through the building. Let's have a look. Because I don't think I can go, go through the building wall and destroy him at the same time. Although you never know, actually. Let's see. Just give it a shot. Okay, that was a bit of the wrong thing to aim at. Okay, I think that'll get him through the window. Oh, man. Oh, that didn't even go completely through either. Oh, what the hell, I mean, it's still just through the wall. I think I should be able to take him out now. He probably can take me out, actually. But nope, he's going to go down first. <laughs> It'd be funny if he could still take me out through the freaking wall. I mean, granted, this thing's gun is pretty good still. And not anymore. I certainly won't be salvaging the gun, that's for sure. Actually, yeah, actually, no, I don't think I can really... Oh, actually, should I try to flank over Lee? It's an incredibly ridiculous idea. Actually, wait a minute, what I could do is maybe try to take care of some of this cover, actually. Not really sure what I'm saying actually so often, but anyway. Yeah, I'll try to take out the cover first, then I might try to flank it just the hell of it. I've managed to do it a couple of times. It's uh, kind of hard to pull off with a freaking uh, turretless vehicle, to say the least. But it can still work though. Ah, uh, wait a minute, I think we might have an actual... Ah, uh, damn it, he turned in my direction. Although... <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute, just one more shot. Oh, the M5 destroyed him. Never mind, I thought I did that for a second. Ah, oh, well. Oh, quiet. Oh, quiet. Just keep rolling this thing in front as well. <laughs> so, what the hell? Let's try to get this thing through the building, just for the hell of it. Although, now he sees, sees me coming. Damn it. And I think there's something else coming in my way as well. Oh my god, and it still didn't fucking destroy it. You've got to be shitting me. <laughs> oh dear. Now what? Well, have a shot, I suppose. Oh shit, there's a couple of guys there. As well, that kind of sucks. Oh, not bad. Well, almost did it. And this guy, why the hell did he fucking decide to slack off? I don't know. Damn it. So I'll take room up. There we go. Got it, sir. This guy needs to lay some freaking mines down. There we go. Yeah, right, I suppose I might as well send up the again. Should be alright to take him out. I might as well try to get him on head on in that case. I think side shot would probably be a bit too much to ask for. Yeah, there we go. We'll just try to fortify as best we can. Mando. So there we go, who'd to think I'd still have quite a few more Men of War videos up my sleeve. As for what our opponents could be doing this round, well they could be trying to support their vehicles a bit better with infantry and all that, so I'm seeing quite a few tanks and such, not too much in terms of infantry that are actually attacking, maybe they're sneaking around, I don't know. My guess is probably not, wait a minute, no, we do have something coming after us there. No. <laughs> oh thank god he mentioned taking out. Ouch, set up a bit of a position there to say the least. Damn it. Well, we should get some more off into the fray. Oh, actually, these guys are still alive. 
Or rather, they just arrived just asleep. Yeah, I hate it too, but that ah, well. What's Keen do? I mean, really. Oh, freaking tank crew with a machine gun shit. Well, this is going to be a pain in the ass. I don't really have anything proper to take out the. Uh, ah, fuck me. I don't have anything proper to take out the, um, the tank in terms of vehicles. I suppose I could try to maybe flank it or something. Okay, I can really think of it. Damn it, for the infantry they've got there, it'll probably spot me though. So if I maybe keep this thing back here. Try to take out the infantry first and then There we go. And then maybe try to take it out of this sink. What's the hell? Ah shit, I probably should set up another one. I suppose this will probably be the more dangerous target still. Ah, oh, shit. Fuck me. Yeah, these guys are not going to have a good time at all, to say the least. Damn it, to fucking hell and back. Alright, well, I suppose there is this flank here that I can try to exploit. Why not? Oh, I actually could send these guys up first, actually, to try to spot anything. But yeah, damn it, that really sucks though. Oops. There we go. Yeah, they're basically going to pin me down. Ah, it's too freaking slow. I probably could have taken at least one shot, but uh, nope. Fortunately not. Actually, wait, wait a minute, what the hell just fired at him? Ah, oh, okay, Hellcat's not bad. Well, actually, how much do they cost again? Well, I can afford a Hellcat if I really want to. Too bad he actually missed both times though. Well, what the hell, we'll see how sneaking in with infantry. See how that gets me. Just had a couple more rifles, I guess. Ah. Screw it. Probably should go up to this thing now instead. So I'm gonna stug. What harm can I possibly do, eh? Actually, where's my rocket span? Ah, oh, damn, of course, it's going to be lagging behind. Well, actually, wait a minute, what about trying to go from now? Alright. Hull destroyed. Perfect. Well, there we go. At least this guy paid for himself. Now, if we could just find where the other tank is... God knows where he is. Hopefully we can just take him out. Where is he? Still got no idea where he is. Damn it. Ah, here we go. And, oh, not bad, even destroying the tyrants. There we go, finally managing to turn things around. I didn't even have to rely on the, uh... No. On the, um... Sneak infantry attack. I'll still go over it anyway, actually, just to see how far I can push with them. I suppose we'll keep the rockets man back here on reserve. And perfect, let's get these guys up to the front once again. Demando. Oh, damn it. Oh, oh fuck, it's there only. Just, uh. Miners, anyway, I suppose, but still, kinda sucks. Actually, this isn't doing too badly in terms of rounds and all that. And, oh shit, I forgot about that. Oh my god, why the hell is it doing that? I don't know. Great, and he's angled his tank a bit as well, though. Maybe if I can get the side armor. Let's see. It's hard to destroy it, better than nothing. I was kind of surprised I actually got that. We still got the rockets man here as a trunk, uh, which I think I might be able to actually use. I can just get a clear path to the tank, which I think I can actually through the hills. Perfect, and oh, very nice actually. I managed to take him out just like that. Not bad indeed. So I guess we'll just keep him there. Screw it. Oh, I forgot about this point. Whoops. There we get these guys to form up a bit as well. And yep, I knew it. Someone was going to have to freaking quit. It was too much to freaking ask for, apparently. Oops, probably should keep this guy hidden as well, actually. In any case, my sneak infantry attack worked somewhat. Well, it would have worked. If it needed to. If my uh, original... Damn it. If my original... Um, 
anti-tank gun push didn't work there. Whoops. Oh, thank god that was a bit of a close one. And, oh, of course the engine's on fire, so I have to get everyone to evacuate the dance floor, as it were. <laughs> and later. Actually, I can get this guy to take out the machine gunner. And what the hell, we've still got a few SMGs here. We'll just try to put it up here, we'll try to take out this guy as well. Oh my god, what the hell is he fucking doing? Why did he have to move up like that? Well, hopefully he'll eventually take that. Nope, of course not. Pitch, <sighs> Well, this is point belongs to us, I suppose. That's, that's good, eh? It's all happening. I just get a few more raftmen up, and let's see. Yeah, of course. The fuck is this thing doing? Is it run out of? No, it hasn't run out of HG rounds. So, ah, oh, whoops. There's actually something else here. Whoops, I didn't even notice that. Well, whatever. This thing should get taken out by the Hellcat. That's right behind it. <laughs> Nicely done, the Siege Master. Nicely done. Thanks for the support, sir. Kind of using the Hellcat as a bit of a rear guard rather than a uh, shoot and scoot anti tank weapon, but uh, yeah, whatever. I'll take it. Speaking of which, oh, okay, we're sending out, forgot about that. Still got bloody machine gunners and all that to worry about, but uh, yeah, should still be alright. So, yeah, so I don't think these hills have really been, uh, well I don't think the opponent has really done anything with these hills actually, I think they've just uh, mostly just left them there for me, which is, well I'm not going to complain about that, it's a nice little area to sneak through. There's also this other area which I've completely neg neglected as well actually, which I suppose I might as well, yeah, maybe just one SMG guy should do the trick. There we go. Just from the side I guess. A couple of these guys, what are they, oh that's right, they're rough man. Now yeah, just send them out, and uh, once again we'll get this freaking point fortified even if I have to sacrifice god knows how many soldiers to get the job done. Well, in any case this thing's back up and running. Continue sh showing their fucking positions, and of course just as I say that the freaking SIG goes after me. Not bad, not bad indeed. Now what? God, that really sucks. Damn it. God, I can't believe some of these guys are still alive. I can't believe this AT gun's still alive, actually. <laughs> well, I can certainly believe he's not alive. Okay, screw it. Let's just go with a sneak attack. Where the hell is the sixth member? Two, three, four, five. Great, he probably got killed in that random artillery explosion. Yeah, well. Well, we'll get there eventually. I mean, I can afford bloody Pershing if I really need one anyway, so... So, yeah. Get a couple of tank men up, and yeah, we should be right. Ah, right. oh, but of course, a freaking barrel needs to be repaired. Of course. Well, I think attacking from an angle like this, I probably should these guys to actually get down. Damn it, machine gunners and all that everywhere, for fuck's sake. Kind of wish this Hellcat would fire them, but oh well. What I can save up... Actually, T29 would probably be a bit too expensive to save up for. Still. This freaking machine gunner though. Oh good, at least he's actually going to do nothing else. If you can demand it. And there we go, finally we can actually fire this thing. I mean, I could have actually got some heavier stuff out, but... Oh well. <laughs> Don't really feel like it. Let's just go with a few more SMGs. Squad, let's actually go for a whole lot of them, in fact. Just to really make sure... Really. Just to really make sure that... Um, Got any cover in the flank there. Yeah, just to really make sure that we can try to go forward in. Yeah, fine, I think it's taken out. Ah, well, plenty more re came from. Let's just send up another one over here. And, uh, there you go. Yes, sir. I mean, really, what what is there more to say? I'm, I'm just going for frontal attacks of a couple of sneak attacks here and there. I could be handling the sneak attacks a bit better. Actually, wait a minute. Screw it, let's just try to get this guy to run across and take this out actually. Yeah, I could be doing a better job with the sneak attacks, but I will. And I probably should be trying to support with something, for God's sake. Some sort of armoured vehicle. That, what the hell? <laughs> yeah, okay, let's get the Pershing out, I suppose. Come on, take crewmen. There we go. 
And good, I don't seem to have any infantry near here either, which is just fine by me. Just fine and dandy, like sour candy. Too bad they have to disintegrate my guys just about to every freaking artillery shots, but oh well. This is war after all, and disintegration is almost assured. It's also assured as the fact that I should be able to make one hell of a sneak attack happen to these guys. There we go. And did I actually... I'm actually not really sure if I took that out myself or not, but... Uh, well, in either case, we've got a rocket man behind their lines, so let's see if we can make the most of it. Get these guys up as well. So, ah, okay, yeah, we've got these infantry there, and this time I probably... Ah, uh, damn it, I didn't mean to cancel this healing sequence. Yeah. Oh, actually, what the hell, let's decapture this point first, and then go after them. <laughs> oh, there we go, nothing like cricket sneaking behind them. Just got love it. So what else to have? Oh, a King Tiger. Could I flank that? Well, I have to watch out for infantry, but uh, otherwise, yeah, maybe. Just get these guys to try to flank as well. There we go. Yeah. Oh, wow, we've won already. That was pretty uh, unexpected. Well, there you go. Good game to our opponents. This has been uh, Dame Didvich signing off.